Makenshi Gatik, so Makenshi Dick Rad's favorite anime. Welcome to another live reaction to Made in Abyss episode 9. Let's get into this. Let's get things moving, man. Made in Abyss episode 9. Come on. I really like last week's episode. It's good. Always in the unmovable. It immovable. I wish this goodbye meant something, but they didn't even develop that blue cheek that much. Let's see how it goes. I can see this series ending on a deadly cliffhanger. This is no way of a single season kind of show, right? I don't know if we'll get a sequel, though. I don't think it's doing as well as something like ReZero. This is the director of Monster. I expected this to be... Like, this is a good show. But it's not... Mo it's not like exceptional or anything. Even coming from a director of Monster. Man. That was my reason to watch it, to be honest. I dig it. And I know that the director doesn't can't fundamentally change what's there, which is the source material. You can't just turn it into a monster, right? But still, you can take some creative liberties, maybe. The depth third layer, great fault. It's not a fault line, it's a fault hole. <laughs> Fuck. Is there any, can you get any light down there? Fucking tiny asshole. Impartial as death. Death is equalizer, it's an absolute truth. Exactly. Well, Yo, yeah, Johan said the same thing. The only thing humans are equal in is death. <laughs> so with some courage. Floundering. We actually like this unjust and unequal world. What's unequal about it when everyone dies? <laughs> What's the fucking karaoke, man? Don't give me the English translation. It never. Do these songs almost never translate well into English? It just makes my eyes shine bright like the torch. Like if someone did a song with those English lyrics in here, it would just be laughed out of the fucking studio. I just want to see the fucking Romanized song so I can sing with the Japanese, man. I think anime is like on a downward trajectory right now, even though it's good, right? Because we have such greatness. Even if you go down a bit, you get good animes. I think anime, anime needs to fundamentally change, man. Seasonally. Mm-hmm. Uh oh, you know, like cinema, you have the art films, the independent, the creative stuff, the experimental stuff, then you got the mainstream stuff. We're heading more towards, with anime, the more the mainstream stuff. Be a bit more experimental, take a risk. If your studio makes bucks like on Attack on Titan, take a risk. Every now and then. We're not getting those though. Apparently, the next Yuasa is out. Little some new f series or films coming out, and the people call it this guy the, the next Masaki Yuasa. Make it right right now. Rex abilities. <laughs> Great fault. Fucking hallucinating this shit, wow. And how the, how do you get light down there? What is down there? Yeah. I mean, it gets easier as you go up here, it just gets harder as you go down. So that's why Reg's gonna get ragdoll, like a. Oh shit. <laughs> Damn, those creatures, man. Exit hole, wow. 
Oh, I see. That's what it is. This is a smaller hole. That's that part of a bigger hole where there's, there is light down there. Fucking hell. Madoka Jack. <laughs> Madoka Jack. Madoka Magica. He's just a tool. He literally just a tool for. Oh man. Glitch me out, yes. Um, but she used them as bait. That's what's. <laughs> this is survival, man. These little kids can do that to such cute little creatures. They're learning. Choose the path of the weak. You see. There's probably a wind current down there, right? The fact that these things can fly like that. There must be some like pockets of air and shit. Nigga. Ah. <laughs> Little guys, he's chucked away their friends. <laughs> their food sauce. Shit. My culture food. The meat is tender and delicious. Wow. <laughs> They're so cute though. <laughs> Look at that. How could you I love this. How could you fucking slow a fucking thing like that? <laughs> Shit. What, like a sea ship? Looks like one. <laughs> Little arc or something. The sea level was much, very lower then. Uh, <laughs> uh, turd. Now she smells it. <laughs> Did I smell it when she walked in? It's the den, Madoka Jackson. Lair. Yeah. Oh my goodness. For a, for a show about a giant hole, a giant, well, a very deep hole, I wish this anime had a little bit more depth, a little bit more depth, rather than just being, feel like just an adventure. There's a mystery and there's an adventure. I leave my helpless channel now. And is this the time to use it though? Oh, there you go. And they got this hole up here, right? He's just blown a bigger hole. Things can come in. Oh, <laughs> head off, man. <laughs> Fucking off. You just created a bigger exit. An entrance as well. Done fucked up. That cry. Crimson split jaw. Holy shit. You'd think they'd be more prepared than this. She knows everything about these creatures, but she's wholly unprepared. One red blaster with incinerator. This one remembers us. Oh shit. 
Fucking oh look at them all cold up there. <laughs> look at they're scared themselves. They're stuck. They're stuck themselves. Do one more blast before you can knock out, man. They fucking stuck themselves. Look how sad they look, man. Well, shit themselves. <laughs> Lost a bit of weight, strong. Ow. <laughs> Out the game, man, for two hours. She's got food supply down there. Stay right here. I hope this weakness means something to this journey. Taijub. Yeah, that cool. Yep. She's got food supply down there. <laughs> All those little things are just jammed in the hole. Yeah. Oh my god, how's she gonna do this? She didn't have to use his long fucking limbs like that to cr trap creatures or some shit. Go sleep, innit? Right? <laughs> Maybe that's what she's smelling. <laughs> oh, Baracuchas. Uh, it's, it puts out a fake scent, right? Is that what it is? It's like um, a Venus flytrap. All the things it catches in its mouth, right? The scent does come up. It is like a Venus flytrap, fly sort of. Nelly Tan Tan Tail. There. Oh, I'm Gamme. What the fuck is going on? Look at the. F <laughs> yeah. Dissolved. Shit. Like stomach acids and shit. <laughs> How's she gonna wash off? She needs to wash that off. Nice. Shit. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh shit. Oh, that stomach acid. It's dead. Oh, well, now she's gonna think. I wonder how this tastes. Get that shit off you, man. Oh my god. What the hell? What is going on? What is it? Why are they attacking her? They're trying to eat her! They're stuck on me. <laughs> That's interesting, man. First, they, they were meant to be her food. Nice. The predator becomes the prey. 
<laughs> Shit, man. Listen, not so cute no more. She's surviving with just a knife, man. It's another hole up. Upward slope. We're gonna first be shown, right? What happens? Maybe these creatures are gonna try going up, and we get to see what happens to smaller creatures. Shit. She's pulling an oars in, huh? Even a tiny ascension like that. Oh shit, the hallucinations will begin. That that is no no turning back, right? This this whole this whole hole, right, is built in in the sense that it it wants to deter people going back. Once you're on your way, it just wants you to keep going down there for a reason. Must be no hallucination, man. Huh? Marulk. Auditory hallucination. Uh, that's enough already. Rico, everybody. Shit. Oh wow, have mom. Let's go back together, back to old. Yeah. How, how is she having this hallucination when she hasn't seen a mum like this? She's never seen pictures of her like this, right? How is she having this hallucination? It's from her own mind, right? If she's never seen a mum like this. Maybe she does got pictures. But you'd think that they show Liza's picture straight away in the middle of the beginning of the series if she had one. Just so you got an idea of who she was. Wow, this is an extremely fucking vivid hallucination. Welcome home. <laughs> There's no way she's home just from that little upward slope, man. <laughs> Leave Reg behind, right? Did she forget about Reg? Even in the hallucination, did she forget about Reg? Congratulations, this is. Congratulations. Yeah, now she thinks of Reg, innit? At the bottom of the nether one. You're here already. You, you return it to Oath. You're, you're there, according to your head. <laughs> wow, just that ascension caused that much fucking distress. Just chill. Take a fucking chill break there, man. Till Red gets up. You, you, you got a big, huge journey ahead of you. <laughs> oh dear, good. Ah, it's f a fat thing still. Fucking hell, I just give up.
No, ¿qué va eso? You're gonna have to blast it again. Oh! Oh shit, the axe, pickaxe. Let's see how well she does. Oh, fuck! That strength. Yeah, Rick, that, Rick's better off with that shit, man. She reminds me of Bastion so much. Oh my. It's like a gun blade, man. Squad's gun blade. <laughs> but it's, it's like a gun axe. <laughs> he fucked that shit up. There you go. It's so annoying, her fucking voices. She was cutesy in the beginning. Now her voice is great on me, man. If I was on impossible, friends are better together. <laughs> My man just wakes up and completely shows her up, man. It's because of the two of us, yep. Now calm on power. Friendship. Better together. Spike here. I can't I, how would you read that? There's nothing there's nothing on that. I had these spikes actually eggs. Eggs! Damn, those spikes are eggs. Fuck you yeah. know. They got almost limitless supply. The goblet of giants. Fourth layer, goblet of giants. <sighs> Alright. I thought that layer was not that not as interesting as I thought it'd be. Yeah, it had some cool flora fauna type stuff going on. This is the origin story, right? This is just a build in the world. So you know what the ge geology is, you know what the architecture is and that kind of thing. But it's just a journey, you're visiting places, that's what I mean. It's about a giant deep hole. I wish there was a little bit more depth, right? A little bit more beyond about these characters. He's still a mystery, the hole's still a mystery. She's got such a basic motivation. I feel as though they're just very archetypal characters right now. But the world's interesting. I think there are some animes where it's really the world and story that are more interesting than the characters. So I'd say this is very much like Shinsuke Yuri in that respect. But I don't think it's anywhere near as as as, as thoughtful as Shinsuke Yuri is. But it's, it's like that in that vein. And they haven't introduced Bunny Chick. This is meant to be a sign-in, right? It was a sign-in magazine that it was... I still don't see why why that was the case. And sign doesn't just mean blood, guts, and gore. It means the, the storytelling and the characters. We'll see. We'll see. It's been a decent show so far. Watchable, you know. Um, nothing really compels me right now. To, I, the minute it goes up. You know, like how people watching One Piece, Naruto, DBS. The minute it goes up. For me, this show ain't... Look, Got that, it doesn't have that effect. Poison and the curse. Alright. People, thank you for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe, follow me on Twitter, blah blah blah. Discord details below. If you if this is your first reaction watching, click that icon on the bottom right to subscribe and turn that notification bell on so you get future updates to these reactions. And thank you very much for watching.